Hey guys, this is Galactic from Galactic's Tutorials, and this is part 3 on how to make a free video game. Um, in this video, we're basically just going to make a, um, a life bar to show you how many lives you have, and um, like a score, and a, main, a high score uh, for your video game, because uh, we're going to go into like a point system in this tutorial. And uh, it's pretty simple, all you have to do is, to start out, is click this uh, create a new object, and we're going to name this one uh, score, and then click add event, create, and then go into the score, and then uh, set your score to zero, and now uh, you can click relative. Uh, this makes it so that when you uh, join the game, uh, your score is set to zero, pretty simple. Um, and now what you're going to do is click another add event and then uh, click the other and then game start now this is pretty much just so that when you start off the game uh, you have a certain amount of uh, things that are present so one of these things is live set that to four uh, and click relative this just means that you have one life to start out as and then you have three extra lives in the top left hand corner like most video games have and um, yeah, it's pretty standard and then click score, make sure it's showing, uh, make sure the lives show as well, but make sure that the health does not show. And you can put this probably at the top right over here. And um, click uh, show high score just because I like having a high score right over here and it's uh, pretty cool to have. So well, yeah, we're just going to keep this one right over here and keep it simple. We're probably going to add on to this later, um, but we're just going to keep it like that for now. So click OK. Now we're going to make another event. Um, you can name it whatever you want. I'm just going to leave it as is. Uh, make it draw. And go into score. Uh, click draw lives. Make it 32 and uh, 32. And then relative. And click OK. Um, basically, this is just dictating where the lives are shown and now drag uh, this right over here uh, make this 10 by 10 and uh, select the sprite that you want now if you want you can have a heart heart sprite to um, uh, see how many hearts you have I like just like using the main character because it makes it nice and simple and uh, we're just going to click that and click OK and now we're going to um, make another object and this is going to be the score and click another draw event and uh, yeah it's pretty simple this step so it's you don't really have to go into a lot of detail and then 32 by 32 and then click relative and okay so once you're done with that all you have to do is go into the rooms and then just make it so that all of your objects are present so you want score to be right over here probably want object number four which is probably like I guess lives right now right over there and then you want object number five which is the actual score right over here maybe a bit lower if you want I'll we'll just keep it up right over there it's it might be a bit hard to see with the uh, background but uh, we'll keep it as is yeah maybe we could delete it I don't know nah we won't delete it we'll just leave it as is and uh, yeah let's play the video game so as you can see, here is the high score. Um, since we can't currently earn points, we're not going to um, really be typing in the high score anytime soon. But to uh, just uh, get past this, just press escape. And uh, as you can see right over here, um, I have uh, lives right over here. And as I've said before, the score is going to be hard to see um, here. So you probably won't see it, but you can see it in the main part of the window if you're curious. And it says that I have three lives, even though I gave him four, but the, as I said before, um, he has one main life, so that's why it only says three, and there's only three here. But, um, yeah, that was pretty easy. Um, that is the basic part of our tutorial right over here. I hope this helped you guys. Um, in the next video, we're probably going to go down the road of enemy mechanics, and uh, how they're going to damage you and stuff and probably the video after that we're going to actually make your character have weapons and stuff 
and uh, show how your character is going to damage the enemies. And um, yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Sorry if this video is a bit shorter than the most and not as infor informative, but we're, we had to get this over with just so that we could have a standard for the enemies uh, in our next video. But yeah, guys, if you like this video, uh, feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time.